Hey guys it's IOGuard here so the baseline iPad is never the most technically stunning or impressive, but it's usually the one most people buy. And we're expecting the iPad 10th gen to be no different. While we wait for the imminent official reveal of the iPad 10th gen. As with most yearly device releases, don't expect a completely new look for the new iPad. Based on a handful of leaked renders that were shared with my smart price, it looks like the 2022 device won't be too different from the 2021 iPad. However, there are a few key differences, with the biggest being a change in camera design seems that the base version of the 2022 model will sport just one back camera with an LED flash. There's currently no word on what sort of lenses the new iPad will sport for either its front-facing selfie camera or its rear shooter. The other major design change is that the 10th generation iPad seems to be adopting USB-C ports for all models, finally, the iPad 10th gen could also move away from rounded edges and adopt flat ones. Currently, there's not much known about the exact internal specs of the 2022 iPad, save for one key detail, it's rumored to be running on Apple's A14 Bionic chip. This is a step up from last year's iPad, which was running on an A13. The A14 performs 30% better than the A13, so users should be able to see a noticeable improvement when comparing the 2021 iPad to the 2022 model. Along with the boost in performance, an A14 chip would potentially allow the iPad 10th gen to support 5 grams connectivity, something the 9th gen model doesn't have iPhone 12 and iPad Air 4. It seems like the iPad 2022 may only support 4GB RAM as a result of running on the A14. That's not the end of the world, as it's pretty standard for a base model Apple tablet, but it's certainly not an improvement over last year's model. iPad 2022 launches, it could be running on iPadOS 15 and then see a quick upgrade to iPadOS 16 when it launches. While we were expecting iPadOS 16 to release in September or October, while it may not be super exciting to know that 2022 iPad owners will have to wait just like everyone else for the new OS, the wait should be worth it. So far, iPadOS 16 has been in a fairly buggy state throughout all of its betas. There's currently no official release date scheduled for the 2022 iPad, but Apple is hosting an event on September 7th where the new iPad could be revealed it all depends on when the new iPad is revealed. If it happens during the September presentation, then it's a safe bet to expect it to launch in late September. The iPad 9th gen starts at $329, just like the iPad 8th general the iPad 10th gen may keep the $329 price or it could be more expensive. So it's possible the iPad 10th gen will see similar treatment. It's too early to say for sure, but it's definitely something to keep an eye on. Please subscribe to my channel inshallah I will see you in the next video.